when I was young, I, I, I did a lot of model plane and, uh, and put it on the, on the, on the roof and in my room. And I wanted to be a, an airline pilot, but uh, it was not so easy. Just after my private lessons, I did my first robotic flight and I said, I want to do that. And, uh, now it's my life. 2003, I think I was in the World Championship with the French team, aerobatic team. A friend of mine asked me if I wanted to, to, to do a race, pylon race. And I said, yes, why not? I came the first time, it was in Budapest. I saw uh, it was not really a race, it was more than a ski slalom. I said, oh, it will be interesting. And uh, the first flight, I remember, it's, it's like my first solo flight. I cannot forget this because it's uh, amazing to fly in the, in the gate. It's, uh, for, for a pilot, it's really interesting. It's, uh, it's really different. We, you, you, we must have a really good experience in aerobatics because we must know the plane, to feel the plane, and uh, we have to, uh, to be only one, the plane and the pilot. But it's really, it's totally different. It's not aerobatics, it's really a new contest and uh, we cannot compare. Uh, we cannot say uh, if you are a good pilot in aerobatics, you will be a good race, uh, race pilot. It's really different. All of us, when we start, we, we learn that now we, we have a lot of feedback and we can um, share the feedback with the, with the rookie and the, it's, it seems to be more easy for the, for, the, for the new pilot to learn that. 2009 started very well, third in Abu Dhabi, the first race, and I won the, the second one. And then I started the, my uh, unlucky times with uh, the last three races that I, I, I did very bad. There is only one race left and I hope I, I will do well. I'm fast with my new plane and uh, I will see. I changed this season with, uh, due to the new regulation. I cannot fly with the previous plane. It was an extra 30 SR. So now I changed this year for the, uh, an H540. And the edge is a little bit faster and easier to, to fly with it. I can compete really a little bit more on the front uh, with, uh, for the first place. It's really nice to be on a podium. but. I have to fly well. You need a good plane and as well a good pilot to, uh, to have a good result. If you do a lot of mistakes, you cannot uh, have a good result. For this, this year, I think the Paul Bonham is uh, now it's a good position to, to win the, uh, his first World Championship because it's, uh, he is four or five points more than the NS, so uh, I think it's a good position to win. But we can see a lot of things. It's, uh, it's still a sport and everything can happen. It's really hard because I, I, I flew very well like for for aerobatics in the Cap 232 and uh, I'm flying now a very nice airplane for the race and uh, I think as well for the aerobatics, the H540. Uh, a kind of mix will be uh, really excellent and uh, maybe the, the best aircraft will be the next one. Flying for me is my life, so I, I, I like to fly and uh, I like to fly aerobatics because I, I like this physical sensation, it's a kind of a drug and uh, if I cannot fly during one week and uh, I'm really like this, I want to fly, I want to do something and, uh, and uh, especially aerobatics. So if I can fly uh, aerobatics with this plane and uh, if I can fly with uh, uh, not especially alone, if I can bring someone with me and uh, I, it's really nice to, uh, to share the, this passion.